So, Don, looks like we're going back to uh, our friends at Luxor this week. And, uh, hey, that bottle kind of looks like Blood Oath. You know, it's one of our favorite distilleries. Blood Oath is known for blending great whiskeys. And this is a blend, but in a different way. Nice. Stay tuned. Hi, welcome to this week's edition of What's New at Charlie's. Well, today we're going to Lux Row. We're going to be opening up a bottle of double single barrel four grain mash bill. Uh, my good friend, Mr. Don Williams of Bourbon Full. Don, how you doing, buddy? Charlie, I'm as excited about this bottle as I've been in a long time. Yeah, well, it looks like Blood Oath, right? It, it looks like a similar bottle. Yeah, yeah, that's what it reminds me of. And uh, mm -hmm. Master Distiller John Remp is is famous for creating Blood Oath. Yes. And this is a blend and it's one of it's a cool idea. Uh, I'm sure other people do it, but this is a single barrel of wheat bourbon mixed with a single barrel of rye bourbon. Two single barrels combined, that's what you get. That's why they call it a double single barrel. Wow. Yeah, I have never heard of that before. So Obviously, four grains means it has usually wheat, rye. Got to have corn, of course, or and then it's got some barley. You know, yeah. to things. So it's a true four grain. But what I love is they're taking a real good single barrel of rye bourbon yes. and a very good single barrel of wheat bourbon and combining them. Nice, nice. So I told you I just came back from Canada and I learned a lot about blending Canadian whiskey. So. Dr. Don would be proud of me for this one. Uh, not this Dr. Don, a different Dr. Don. Uh, but yeah, so that's kind of what they're doing. They're blending two different kinds of whiskey together to make something, take two things and hopefully make it better, right? Yeah, and um, what, what it kind of reminds me of is the, the first barrel that you and I collaborated on yeah. uh, was basically blending two barrels, if you remember. Yeah, the Woodford, yeah. The, the yeah. Woodford. Uh, so I'm excited to see about this. I, I love Lux Row. It's one of my favorite stops. Uh, they do a lot of cool things, and uh, this is going to be one of them. Absolutely. Well, let me go ahead and pop it open. You got any more info for us? Uh, well, you know, uh, Lux Row's a, a place that, you know, they've only been around since 2018. Mm -hmm. uh, but, you know, they've made an impact there. You know, they have Ezra Brooks. They have Rebel. They have Blood Oath, they have David Nicholson, they have Davies County, you know, a lot of those, you know, we've done some things with. Yeah. Uh, and uh, they're just good people there. It's kind of a cool facility in Bardstown. Yep. And they've recently teamed up with uh, the guys at MGP where we were just at. That, that's right. Everything kind of goes full circle and our good friends at Limestone. Absolutely. So, yeah. So, um, do we know, do you know proof on this? Or? Yeah, it's uh, 115. Okay, okay. You know, yeah. so it's it's yeah. right there. It's and, right where we like and it. Did you know anything about the two whiskeys? I, I don't, I couldn't get individual mash bills. Okay, all right, cool. Uh, but again, let's try it. Let's see what we got here. Cheers. Definitely get the corn. It's sweet on the front end. Um, it's definitely got a little hug to it. It's definitely 115 it's definitely proof. Definitely 115 proof. Um, uh, smooth, good mouth mouthfeel. Yeah, great. Um, real kind of a syrup taste to me. Uh, that's, you know, the corn on the front end. Yeah, absolutely. I really like that. that that's it, very nice. That's very nice. Um, very unique. Yeah. And I'm trying to get something to stand out, but it's just kind of all blends really well. Yeah. It's, it, yeah. It, it's 
nothing, you know, the ride doesn't jump out at no, you, the uh -uh. wheat doesn't jump no, out exactly. at you. No, exactly. That's what I was looking for. So, Very nice pour of whiskey. Yeah. So recently you talked about um, a whiskey that you added some water to and it really changed the profile to. Yes. I bet this is one. I bet you're right. Yeah. That would open up tremendously. Yes. Uh, yeah. But I'll tell you what, I, I'm really impressed. I, I really think that this is a cool product and it's combining a single barrel rye bourbon with a single barrel wheat bourbon. Simple concept and uh, it's a pretty cool product. It's fantastic. So if you like a big bourbon, you're going to like this because yeah. it's, it's a big bourbon. It's it, not a... It is a serious yeah, bourbon. It's a serious bourbon. But if you like that, you're really going to like this. So um, you should probably come to Charlie's and give it a try. That'll be our whiskey of the week this week. It is a awesome whiskey. And sure. after, after this, I might add a drop of water and see where it goes for me. But cheers, buddy. Cheers. Thanks. Thank you, everyone. Thanks, everyone.